intro footage, so I'm just gonna do it here. <laughs> Hello kiddos and welcome back to my channel. Mm. Today I'm doing a cute little haul lookbook type thing, but these are Bella Hadid slash 90s fashion inspired. Um, I got them from Bella Hadid, like her street fashion and everything. Cause at first I was just gonna do a whole video on her, but then I decided to kind of create my own little outfit. So some are recreated and some are just me, my mind. But if you're new, hi, my name is Javi. I am a curve model and a social media influencer. So I hate that word. I hate that word. I hope you subscribe because it's free and you get a cookie and follow my Twitter, my Instagram and my Snapchat because I do things on there. And all right, so first outfit. Now, I will tell you right now, I don't know the names of half of these things, so I will obviously have them all linked in my description box. Another thing is that this is also a video that's featuring my favorite jeans at the moment, so definitely go cop them because I have been wearing them every single day. Yeah, any pair of jeans that you see in this video are literally my favorite and you should buy them because <laughs> I've been wearing them constantly. All right, first outfit. I'm gonna start with probably my favorite outfit out of the ones that I made. Well, for one, I wanted to make this an outfit. Let me see. It's just the bodysuit here, like the bodysuit situation in this, uh, you know, I bought it, it's too big. Um, and it's awkward. But my idea was literally this outfit. So let's pretend this was one of the outfits as well because it's super cute. Just pretend this is like a crop top because I think that's what I'm gonna make it into. But yeah, boom. All right. <laughs> That's this was one of the outfits. I just when I put it on the fabric of this is a little bit on the frumpy side And like you can tell it's like a little bit stiff and so wearing it as a bodysuit felt really awkward to me And it looked weird when I tucked it into my pants So that's why it's not really in the lookbook, but technically it is if that makes sense But anyways, we're just gonna talk about it. Whatever. It is a ribbed material. It's almost like a knit fabric It's not really cottony it is stretchy though, like very, very stretchy, which I think that's why I think I'm just gonna make it into more of a crop top. It's low, I mean, it's, it has no back, <laughs> okay? And then the clasps are, you know, obviously they're intact. I haven't even, but this is like a full coverage bodysuit. So I'm just like, I've always said, I'm not a fan of full coverage bodysuits because I have a big bum and so most of the time it doesn't even close but it fits really big everywhere else nonetheless though I would probably just crop it I tend to fix up my shirts and tops and stuff anyway so I was gonna do something with this regardless then these jeans guys these jeans are a freaking dream I think they're called killing me softly jeans that's the name of them but they're a little bit flared and they have a slit on the sides on like the outer sides and the fabric y'all is just so it just fits so nice and they're not super high-waisted they're more of a mid-rise slash high-rise really it it comes right up to my belly button but you can even hike them up and make them a little bit more high-rise for you I do have a short torso so this is just what it looks like on me flare denim has been coming back anyway and I wanted to get on the trend because I think they're so cute and it actually looks really really good on curvy women also none of these outfits will be like a hundred percent Bella Hadid they're more so just what she wears and how I would style it or what I would wear regarding her style, you know? Okay, just so nobody's like, oh my god, but these don't even look like her. Whatever. Next outfit, which is actually definitely my favorite. <laughs> it is very simple, but so freaking, oh my gosh. I just, I die. I we have light wash denim, a black tee, and a fanny pack, and some cheetah girl boots. I'm calling cheetah girl, they're cheetah print, whatever. We're gonna talk about the shoe first because they are so sassy looking. I don't have any boots like these. Usually I wear like a block heel because I just feel more comfortable. But I tried these on, they actually are not very uncomfortable. But I think it has to do with the material because it feels very structured and I feel like I'm not gonna crack my ankles in half. 
I really like them. They also have a little bit dazzling right here and it went really well with the studs in my fanny pack. So yeah, these are so cute. There's like felt right here on the inside too. Makes them more comfortable, a little bit more cushiony as well. But yeah, I love these. There's a nice pointed toe, which makes you look taller. It makes you look long legged. Then the light wash jeans. I love these. When I tell you, skinny jeans are great and all, but like once you buy a nice pair of flared or nice pair of relaxed denim, them. you cannot go back I literally cannot go back so these are just straight legged light wash denims I got them in a size 31 by far one of my favorite jeans I do wish they were a little bit tighter on the waist because they are a little bit relaxed so this is the thing like I wish they were tighter on the waist so that I feel like I'm accentuating my body the best and then just relax all the way through and just a black top now this black top is like so different <laughs> because it's so stretchy wait this top is ridiculously stretchy i don't it's ribbed material it's so it's just the oops i love the neckline of it because it kind of opens up your chest area and if you have like a nice chest like me <laughs> Or you don't have a lot of boob this shirt makes you look like you have real nice boobies I'm not gonna lie I usually don't wear bras and this is like the perfect top for that because it just it lifts them up because it's so elastic and in the back it actually crisscrosses next outfit next outfit is a very interesting ensemble I'm not gonna lie I put it on and I was like hmm a questionable sense of fashion but I feel like this is something that people would wear back in the day because I've seen a lot of freaking butterflies and I've seen a lot of little weird shirts with patterns so i went with like a little butterfly graphic tee that's like tied and it's like cut in the middle and i don't know it was giving me 2000s like spice girls vibes to be honest so because bella had like an all-white outfit i think i saw an all-white outfit i think i don't know i decided to wear white flare jeans these are so freaking cute i love those jeans they're so nice however the fabric is on the see-through side which sucks but if you wear uh underwear that matches your skin tone you won't be able to tell so don't wear white underneath and don't wear black just wear a skin tone color so whatever that may be for you i just put on my sneakers with it because sneakers just go with everything i'm sorry i'm so sorry i will say though you might need some pieces or something for this shirt because this shirt is like a little unsafe <laughs> on the unsafe size so if you lift your arms up you will see everything but yeah the jeans fit amazing um i got them in a size 50 I believe I just love a good comfortable jean, you know, okay next I'm tired. <sighs> I have another interesting choice. I don't know. I was when I was looking at her pictures I was like these look very interesting. I just I don't know what she was thinking, but it's kind of a vibe I mean, I was feeling it, you know, that's why I picked it So anyways, there's a picture where she's wearing like a huge hoodie and like flare jeans and weird shoes but like sneakers and just like very interesting handbag which i'm sure is probably like ten thousand dollars but it doesn't look it <laughs> the shade so i went with my flare jeans the killing me softly flare jeans slit or split whatever um with my yeezys because they were like a oatmeal color and she was wearing like a weird i don't know they weren't white sneakers and then i just have a black hoodie um i wanted this hoodie to be bigger but i got it from the men's section and I don't know maybe they're cutting things very small i don't know but it was supposed to be a very big slouchy one and i don't have one right now or i think i think i put it with all my winter clothes and i have no idea where they are i don't feel like looking for it so i just got this hoodie and it says f off yeah yeah so very simple outfit but obviously i paired it with some nice sunnies very 90s early 2000s looking um i love those they're just very comfortable to wear just all jet black just like the nice rectangle shape and i feel like it made it look real nice the hoodie itself very very comfortable it's just very simple i wanted i want i needed it to be simple because her hoodie it had some interesting graphics but i couldn't find anything that looked like it and i don't know if that was like a designer hoodie honestly i don't know again it didn't look like it so the jeans that have like a really nice wash again my favorite i got them in a 13 these black ones that i'm wearing right now also in a 13 they're the same jeans just in different colors and i think they have dark darker denim 
but I choose like the charcoal gray ones or like faded black and medium wash I think or the light wash I can't remember oh and underneath I have a black turtleneck you guys know I love turtlenecks turtlenecks are my life obviously I wouldn't wear this out now in the summer when it's humid hot 90 degrees would never could never would never be me but in the winter more than likely yes um i wear hoodies all the freaking time and i do wear them with a turn like it just looks really really good any top sometimes just looks really good with a turn like under it okay then we have another outfit that's actually very freaking cute like, it's a red bandana top uh not strapless uh well yeah like two top it comes to like a little point but it's not long enough so sometimes it kind of just you know rolls up on you very very cute i love that top so much very stretchy cottony fabric and i also really like that on the inside it has like a little I guess flap and so it covers the chi chis a little bit more and then with it i paired it with my cortez sneakers and these crazy <laughs> oversized like boyfriend jeans or mom jeans i don't really know what to call them anymore they're just really big I will say I got them in a size 14 and they're very, very, very big on my waist. Like, you will see how big they are. Um, So I definitely will have to take them in a little bit because I really like how relaxed they look. Like, they fit my thighs great and the rest of, like, the rib part looks really, really good. I tried them in a 15 and they were very small. So I'm just confused by the sizing. My advice is these are meant to be oversized. These are meant to be, like, big on you. So if they fit big then you know that's pretty much the point so i wasn't super upset but i definitely will take them in a little bit because the gap right there is like on the big side and i have actually two pairs of those jeans because i really really like them i just love the look of them with some sneakers like oh my gosh it's such a y'all i've been saying it's such a vibe a lot but you get it you understand in but yeah i really like this outfit it's very very cute and the last outfit very simple i just figured i would play with a little more color so i got a cute little yellow top but i don't have anything that looks like this oh i actually have the tag in this still it's called the sweet embrace rouge crop top i honestly just like the detail it gives it a nice little special detail a special touch because i don't really have any i have a lot of crop tops that look like this like the silhouette of it but the rouging part i don't have so i thought that was a really cute different style that i could try and then i paired it with the black jeans that i'm wearing right now and some sneakers and a nice little necklace i definitely think it's really me and the yellow also makes my tan pop and i really really like that um the top is like a stretchy spandex material it's like but it's very soft and lightweight so i think it's perfect for summer and that's it for these outfits my little bella hadid outfit inspo on a size 14 body i hope you guys enjoyed let me know who you want me to do next because these are a lot of fun like trying to find different outfits and honestly sometimes it doesn't work but for the most part it does and you know you make it work the best that you can so yeah be great be kind be nice Wear SPF, drink your water, don't be racist. And I hope you're having a wonderful day or a wonderful day whenever you're watching this. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.